In this video, we'll be taking a look at three WNBA games happening on June 15, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three WNBA games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive sports picks to take your journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best single picks, parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Connecticut Sun vs. Atlanta Dream The Atlanta Dream and Connecticut Sun meet Thursday in WNBA action at the Mohegan Sun Arena. The Dream sit with a 3-5 record overall, but they are coming off an impressive victory in the last game. The Dream scored 86 points against the New York Liberty, and that was enough to win by 7 points. The Dream had 6 different players that finished with at least 12 points. Alicia Gray finished with 16 points, 6 rebounds, and 1 assist. The Dream are averaging 83 points while their defense is giving up 85 points per game. The offense is ranked 4th while the defense is ranked 11th. Alicia Gray has been the top player for the Dream this season averaging 16.9 points while shooting 43.6% from the field. The Sun have been strong this season and they currently sit with an 8-2 record overall. In the last game against the Atlanta Dream, the offense put up 89 points, and that was enough to secure the 12-point victory. Brianna Jones had a strong game finishing with 18 points, 8 rebounds, and 2 assists. The Sun are averaging 82 points while their defense is giving up 78 points per game. The offense is ranked 6th in the league while the defense is ranked 2nd in the WNBA. Duana Botter has been the top player for the Sun averaging 17 points while shooting 41.3% from the field and 31% from deep. The Dream are 4-1 against the spread in their last five road games and 4-1 against the spread in their last five games playing on one day's rest. The Sun are 11-1 against the spread in their last 12 Thursday games and 22-10-1 against the spread in their last 33 games overall. The Under is 13-6 in Dream last 19 Thursday games. The Over is 5-1 in Sun last 6 overall. The Dream are 0-5 against the spread in the last 5 meetings. The Connecticut Sun are the better team on paper, they've been the sharper team overall, and they already beat the Dream on the road this season. However, the Dream don't get blown out often, they have the horses offensively to hang around, and they They've had covering success on the road. Heck, the Dream just beat the Liberty on the road. I'll take a shot with the points, so the Atlanta Dream to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. The Atlanta Dream are averaging 83 points on 41.8% shooting and allowing 85 points on 41.9% shooting. Alicia Gray is averaging 17 points and 5.9 rebounds, while Ryan Howard is averaging 16 points and 2.9 assists. Cheyenne Parker is the third double-digit scorer and Ad Dur is grabbing 1.1 rebounds. The Atlanta Dream are shooting 34.9% from beyond the arc and 81.3% from the free throw line. The Atlanta Dream are allowing 33.3% shooting from deep and are grabbing 37.1 rebounds per game. The Connecticut Sun are averaging 82 points on 42.5% shooting and allowing 78 points on 42.4% shooting. Dewana Botter is averaging 17 points and 4 rebounds, while Brianna Jones is averaging 15 points and 2.4 assists. Melissa Thomas is the third double-digit scorer and Tiffany Hayes is grabbing 3.3 rebounds. The Connecticut Sun are shooting 33.8% from beyond the arc and 70 4.5% from the free throw line. The Connecticut Sun allowing 30.1% shooting from deep and are grabbing 36.2 rebounds per game. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. Chicago Sky vs. Indiana Fever The Indiana Fever and Chicago Sky meet Thursday in WNBA action at the Wintrust Arena. The Fever sit with a 3-6 record overall and they are coming off a victory in the last game. The Fever scored 87 points against the Washington Mystics and that was enough to secure the 21-point victory. Alia Boston had a strong game finishing with 23 points and 14 rebounds.
Kelsey Mitchell also had 19 points. The Fever are averaging 81 points while their defense is giving up 82 points per game. The offense is ranked 7th while the pitching is ranked 8th. Kelsey Mitchell has been the top player for the Fever averaging 17 points while shooting 43.2% from the field and 38.6% from behind the three-point line. The Sky sit with a 5-5 record overall, but they are coming off another loss in the last game. The Sky's defense gave up 93 points against the Las Vegas Aces, and that was the difference as they were defeated by 13 points. The Sky were led by Marina Mabry, who finished with 20 points, 3 rebounds, and 2 assists. The Sky is averaging 79 points while their defense is giving up 81 points per game. Kali Cooper has been the top player for the Sky, averaging 17 points while shooting 41.8% from the field and 42 2.1% from behind the three-point line. The Fever are 3-0-1 to against the spread in their last four road games and 5-1-1 to to against the spread in their last seven games overall. The Sky are 3-0-1 to against the spread in their last four home games and 7-2-1 to to against the spread in their last ten games overall. The Over is 7-1 to in Fever last eight road games. The Under is 12-5 to in Sky last 17 overall. The Fever are 8-3-2 to to against the spread in the last 13 meetings in Chicago and 5-0 0 to 1 against the spread in the last 6 meetings. The Chicago Sky are getting the benefit of the doubt because they're supposed to be the better team and they're at home. However, the Indiana Fever are getting better each time they play, something I've said for over a week now. The Fever's last seven games have been impressive, and they've won two of their last three games. The Chicago Sky still have defensive issues to fix. I'll grab the free bucket with the team in better form, so the Indiana Fever to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. The Indiana Fever are averaging 81 points on 43.6% shooting and allowing 82 points on 41.3% shooting. Kelsey Mitchell is averaging 17 points and 2.1 assists, while Alia Boston is averaging 15 points and 7.9 rebounds. Nalissa Smith is the third double-digit scorer and Erica Wheeler is grabbing 2.2 rebounds. The Indiana Fever are shooting 31.6% from beyond the arc and 75.2% from the free throw line. The Indiana Fever are allowing 34.5% shooting from deep and are grabbing 37.2 rebounds per game. The Chicago Sky are averaging 79 points on 42.5% shooting and allowing 81 points on 43.7% shooting. Holly Cooper is averaging 17 points and 5.4 rebounds, while Marina Mabry is averaging 16 points and 4 rebounds. Alana Smith is the third double-digit scorer and Dana Evans is dishing 4.1 assists. The Chicago Sky are shooting 35 points 4% from beyond the arc and 76.3% from the free throw line. The Chicago Sky are allowing 31.6% shooting from deep and are grabbing 36.2 rebounds per game. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. Las Vegas Aces vs. Seattle Storm The Seattle Storm and Las Vegas Aces face off on Friday in a WNBA showdown at Mandalay Bay Events Center. The Storm sit with a 2-6 record overall and they are coming off a victory against the Phoenix Mercury. The Storm scored 83 points against the Mercury and that was enough to win by 14 points. Jewel Lloyd had a strong game finishing with 17 points, 4 rebounds, and 4 assists. The Storm are averaging 75 points while their defense is giving up 82 points per game. The offense is ranked 11th while the defense is ranked 6th. Jewel Lloyd has been the top player for the Storm averaging 25 points while shooting 39.2% from the field and 366.4% from behind the three-point line. The Aces sit with an 8-1 record overall and they are coming off another victory in the last game. The Aces scored 93 points and that was enough to win by 13 points. Ajan Wilson was the top player for the Aces finishing with 21 points, 10 rebounds, and 3 assists. The Aces are averaging 91 points while their defense is giving up 79 points per game. The offense is ranked first in the league while the pitching is ranked third. The Aces want to push the pace and there is no doubt they are going to try and push the pace in this game. Haja Wilson is averaging 20 points while shooting 55.8% from the field. The Storm are 3-0-1 to to against the spread in their last four road games and 5-1-1 to to against the spread in their last seven games overall. The Aces are 1-5 to against the spread in their last six Thursday games and 1-4 to against the spread in their last five games overall. The under is 4-0 to in Storm last four overall. The over is 4-1 to in Aces last five overall. The Storm are 3-8 to against the spread in the last 11 meetings. On paper, this matchup isn't great, and the Las Vegas Aces have been a buzzsaw for much of nine games. 
games. It wouldn't be shocking to see a bloodbath in this game. With that said, this is as big of a line as you're going to see in the WNBA, and I'm not thrilled to leave this many points on the table. Just how motivated are the Aces to blow a team out this badly? Also, the Storm did just beat the Mercury on the road, for whatever that's worth. Too many points for my taste. So the Seattle Storm to cover the spread as underdogs is our full game side pick. The Seattle Storm are averaging 74.8 points on 38.8% shooting and allowing 82 points on 44.7% shooting. Jewel Lloyd is averaging 24.7 points and 3.7 assists, while Ezzy Magbiger is averaging 13 points and 8.6 rebounds. Ivana Dodgkick is grabbing 1.2 rebounds and Jordan Horston is dishing 1.3 assists. The Seattle Storm are shooting 33.3% from beyond the arc and 76.2% from the free throw line. Line. The Seattle Storm are allowing 38.4% shooting from deep and are grabbing 34.1 rebounds per game. The Las Vegas Aces are averaging 91.3 points on 49.3% shooting and allowing 79 points on 41.4% shooting. Aja Wilson is averaging 20 points and 8.2 rebounds, while Jackie Young is averaging 20 points and 4.4 rebounds. Kelsey Plum is the third double-digit scorer and Chelsea Gray is grabbing four rebounds. The Las Vegas Aces are shooting 35.4% from beyond the arc and 80.8% from the free throw line. The Las Vegas Aces are allowing 39% shooting from deep and are grabbing 35.2 rebounds per game. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.